a couple of uh, other places, I think. Oh, we took over Terrafon too. We took over a large sum of worlds in this in such a short in such a short episode, which I'm actually very proud of for the first time. Um, okay, but for today's episode, we are going to be taking out Chandrilla, which Let's is go. an ancient world. Oh, we took over Borlias too. We took over a lot of worlds. Um, we're pumping out crazy numbers of capital ships like like no tomorrow right now. Uh, and prepping a fleet for an assault on uh, Kuat. We got a lot of we got a lot of worlds to really work with right now. Um, Kuat's gonna be a big one. They don't really have much here defensive wise. All the major Imperial fleets are stuck between these two worlds, pretty much. Uh, a couple of things up here, um, but it's all nothing too crazy. Nothing that we can't beat. I have zero idea, and I mean literally zero freaking idea for what's at um. At a uh, at a uh, uh, Bill Brinke, I have no idea. Let's go see though. Riot, Megiddo. Ooh. If only you could be so bold. Let's go see. Well, that's about. What's happening here, at Bill Brinke? Okay, we can't see anything, which makes sense. Okay. Riding my Guido is actually very cash money because I think they have starfighter production facilities here Which would make it More or less harder for us. it would make it a lot harder for us to actually raid the planet So if that is the case wow her voice is loud if that is the case We actually might be able to just straight up raid Karita that honestly might happen That'd be really easy and really quick and to the point. It wouldn't be too tough to pull off um, Gonna be building a bunch of these justice classes uh, just because we saw the abilities they had and I really haven't fully utilized those units abilities. So why not? We got a lot of ships to spare a lot of really cool and fun units for our advancing fleets and our growing military might like, We also have a Republic Star Destroyer now too. Let's move it all down here Looks like they're allocating forces to Chandrilla as well Hmm We're gonna see what happens up here really quick. Gunboat here, sir. What the hell? Construction complete. Hmm. The artillery piece is the only thing that's realistically keeping us from winning this uh, safely. But we could do this on paper. Hmm. Because they got some pretty cheap infantry units. Let's let, 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 let's give it a shot. Wait, where's Leia? Oh, she has to be with this force. I know. I know. Do you really know Leia? Because <clears throat> if we can get that raid to go successfully, and they don't have, they don't have any uh. <clears throat> Air units, this this will be quick and easy and to the point. And they also don't have bombing runs and all that stuff either. Let's go. Let's call on all the major heroes. These guys. Okay, I'm not calling any of the other units because we can't rebuild them. Okay, let's take these turrets really quick. There we go. Quick, easy, and to the point. Let's secure these turrets over here next. Oh, that's perfect. These Mandalorians will go a long way in helping us uh, take out those walkers, which again are going to be the bigger issues. Okay. Put up these uh, anti-vehicle turrets really quick. Okay. Circle these guys down here. We're gonna put turrets up where we just lost, where we just destroyed these. Okay. 
Yeah, let's get you guys down here. Okay. So it's going to be ready in a moment, unless we can get the Empire to retreat. How great would that be? Okay. Okay. Move up ever so slightly. I want to keep these guys alive as best of the ability as I can. Take that out really quick. Okay. Chewie, can you steal this? Can you steal this? You can. Okay. I'm gonna have him do that. Well, here's the... The walker. Should we keep some of this? I didn't even think about just stealing the walkers. That guy is so dead. Here we go. Okay. Can you give me a hand with this? Where's their uh, other walker at? That's all right. It's like meshed in with this one. Take it easy. Come on. What's wrong? Okay. That's one. Cool. That worked out perfectly. Okay. This is actually working out very nicely. Can you guys move? <clears throat> there we go. Yeah, let's hammer those guys. Perfect, let's pull back, let's peel back a little bit. All right, he's dead. All right, screw it, we just should commit. We should just commit to this. One more walker. They've taken some heavy losses. Okay, let's um Nice. Oh, I just realized all we had to do is destroy that vehicle. Nice! Excellent. Excellent, excellent work. Akbar Sweet can go ahead and intercept them now. What a turn of events, honestly. Let's get them more reinforcements on the planet, but they also can't. The uh, Empire can't do anything else here. All right, that's perfect. It didn't. We definitely, definitely took our, share, our fair share of losses, um, but that worked out nicely. The perfect place for a riot event. We'll put those there. Uh, 
if we all the infiltrators we can get built here built. Okay, yeah, that's pretty much it right there. <clears throat> Let's get some decently low tier. Actually, yeah, we don't need to build these guys anymore. We'll just build these. Pretty sure we have, yeah, we have an interdictor in the sweet too. They're not going anywhere. <laughs> They're not going anywhere. This is going to work out nicely. Okay. That's a big nebula. Got the three best battleships in our fleet here. Okay. The Oaks here, Commander. Hey, we're reporting. Moving out. Okay, they're gonna have their own support ships, but I think we should be able to hold out. We're able to pick them at range too. They've got plenty more starfighters than we do by a mile. But that's okay. Standing by. Ready for orders. We're going in. Hey, we're reporting. Keep tight for me. Alright. All four all fighters forward. Imperial Starfighters at point two six. Okay. Bomber squadrons, you can start making your moves. Top bombers are breaking off to the right. Okay. Akbar, you help focus down on that star, uh, star destroyer to our right. Here we go. Hmm, those bombers are doing something suspicious. Move over to the right over here. Okay, let's go for the shields on that one now. Dreadnought Mark II coming upon us. Okay. Okay. It's going well so far. That's it. Just keep it. Just keep it the pressure. I started off about taking out some of the little ships. Okay, your job is going to be to take out that Star Destroyer. Just aim directly for the hole. Okay. Our shields are definitely going to go down on that, on that cruiser. Focus all fire on that Star Destroyer. End it. Go, go, go. Nice. Good shooting. This is perfect. Back them up, back them up. We need help. All our bombers have gone out very far. That's okay, just focus up on them if you can. Corvette, move over here. Okay, now for the trap. Five, four, three, two, one. Interdictor active. All right, take out, take out that Arquid Inspector. It's causing them just way too many issues. Here we go. Okay. 
Easy kills, everybody. Easy kills. Focus all fire on the Dreadnought Cruiser. Oh, it procs a shield even though it has no shields? Oh. Oh, not really. Okay. Here we go. That should be it. There we go. Perfect. Perfection. All right. Can we put a main faction base here? Yeah, we can. So we'll put all three, three structures here. That went a lot better than I thought it would. Thankfully, we were able to clear it up thanks to the rioting we did on the planet. Couldn't have come at a more perfect time, honestly. Okay. That's okay. We can now actually refocus our efforts. Ten Star Destroyers are above Yaga Minor. What kind of stuff do they have planet side though? I'm on it. Well, no matter the case. No matter what the case may be for that planet, we're gonna continue with our operations down south. Okay. That damn Starfighter facility would be our biggest uh would be our biggest um, obstacle for a planetary invasion. Reporting. Let's go. All right. Well, whatever we decide to do here, it really won't matter. Let's rotate you here. Let's move you here. Uh, they sure are moving a lot of stuff around. All I hear is hyperspace jumps. Okay. It shouldn't take too much effort to conquer Chandrilla. Upgrade under construction. They almost have a hundred thousand credits, I just realized. Upgrade under construction. Let's get that going. Let's get this going. Uh that's a big win for the Republic if I ever saw one. Put that in production. A few of these lighter vessels. The works. Hmm. I hate that we have this base out here in the middle of nowhere, basically. Can we build that at a better planet? Oh, whatever. Under construction. Yeah, we can put them at... Wait, aren't they cheaper here? Or am I tripping? I'm tripping. Okay. Okay, this should be a relatively easy fight. <sighs> Nothing too crazy. It's also the birthplace of Ben Solo. Yeah, that's bad Solo. Disgusting. We have to nuke this planet, cleanse it of the Disney sins. I'm gonna expect a Star Destroyer. Yep. Okay. Okay. Damn, we really don't have much in terms of Starfighter power right now. Uh, I was about to say, where the hell are the rest of our fighters at? So we can get some E Wings too? B Wings here, Commander. Okay, they're launching all their B Wings. Yes, yes. These, these are great. Where are the E Wings? Give me those E-wing flights. There they are. 
Okay. Perfect. All right, let's go. Why am I stuttering so hard all of a sudden? Huh, weird. I, I can look forward to the day that these older models get replaced with something really, really sexy. I hope they keep the same design, just the textures get changed. Uh, is this going to be one of those laggy battles? That's kind of vibe I'm getting right now. Yeah, look at that, look at that, look at that stutter. One, two, three, four. <laughs> That's okay. We'll get through it. I honestly don't know why I was doing this, though. If we have to restart mid-video, I'll do it, obviously. But I just want to get to the to the to the combat. At least next time I move for I'll start up a little closer. If we just don't look at them, it'll go faster. Trust me. So we've got an iron barrage. So the Republic. Are... Hmm. Okay. Ship of the line. Damn, we really are doing this, hunt game? We're, we're just gonna settle like this. The Imperials have shown themselves. Focus all fire and then start a story to the left. Damn, this is annoying, actually. Let's make this quick. That's... That is a lot of TIE Fighters. You have charge of those ion cannons. Hold your position here. That's a lot of TIEs. Yeah, all bombers, fighters, everybody included. Get into the fray with the fighters. You gotta keep them distracted a little bit. Kaylee's are some amazing anti starfighter weaponry. There we go. Okay. They're getting shredded right now, probably because of those uh, damn gumbos that are hanging out. Their fighters are getting eaten alive. Holy smokes. All of our fighters got completely wiped out. That is new. They shouldn't be able to catch up with the K-Wings when we have them set to full engine power. But, we have nothing to really deal with their Starfighters now. Screw it. Everybody just get as close as possible. Damn. Launch a reserve flights. Go help them out, please. Those B-Wings need help. Bully it with all your extremely powerful guns. We just lost the engines on this assault freaking too. Star Destroyer destroyed. That's a lot of ties still coming out of the hangar bay. There we go. Okay. Do we have more E-Wings? We only have one E-Wing squadron, reserve squadron, that launched. Okay, we're slowly launching more fighter support. Here we go. Corvettes, go up ahead. Proton torpedoes are 
torpedoes are armed and ready. Moving out, boss. There we go. That suffering is gonna uh, took a beating, boss. but that's okay. Okay, with the station's gone, the lag is gone. Good to know. There's another E-wing flight. Okay. Let's go. Okay, the Corvettes will take that out. Those, oh, take out those Starfighters. And the constant guns from our <laughs> capital ships will deal with what's left. Alright, cool. There's no, this doesn't have an animation for that. Well, it kind of does. Okay. Show me the way. All right. I like this little contingent group, we, our little group of uh, troops we got right now. The force will guide me. And then we can finally uh, link up the remainders over here with them. That'd be nice. We just finished production on another cruiser too. Is there a limit on these? Or there's no limit on the Nebula classes. Good to know. All right. These troops have seen some of the worst of the war. <laughs> these Coda troops, man, they've seen it all. We'll drop more tanks this time. We'll drop like maybe a, a couple of U-wing squads. Um, yeah. Just crashed. All right, we, I, not even we, I royally screwed up, or the game crashed, as we all know. So it's actually like two days later. I had to completely redo that, uh, that assault on the planet. We never got that same riot again, so we couldn't just raid the planet and successfully kill everything. I had to go through the whole effort of a space battle and whatnot, and actually lost a lot of ships, including Akbar, which I know a lot of people would have hated because it was stupid and dumb the way I lost them. So I reloaded it again. This time I sacrificed the mediator that we had. This fleet actually was a lot bigger than the last time we left off. <laughs> but all right, we're back into the fray. Uh, we got to add more ships to this battle group again. We, we took some... Uh, we took some L's. <laughs> but we got a long way to go still. We got to still raid Chandrilla, which hasn't crashed on me ever since then. I don't know what the hell caused the crash to begin with, but... Uh, yeah, we can raise Shandrilla now. And the Empire has belators all over the damn galaxy now. I'm pretty certain they've got one at Yaga Minor, and they keep canceling construction of that one. Um, but, either way, we can finally make some progress. I'm probably going to attack Ku at it at some point or another in this episode. Um, we got a mission. Upgrade space stations. Alliance warship dockyard at Eddie 4. Sure. Okay. Well, how's that spelled? Oh. All right. Well, anyway, I got a bunch of capital ships over here, so I'm going to send down to Salukamai, Salukamai, and then I will do our thing over at Chandrilla. I forgot I didn't attack this planet already, so I'll probably either cut that or just go in and swiftly and quickly murder all of them. I set the main fleet down. Okay, that's the construction of this. Got some assault frigates building up here. A lot of people want to see the assault frigates in action. So I'll try to make a, get a few of them going so we can get that done. I'll send this fleet over to Merker. This guy, you're going to join the primary battle group here. I also just realized we don't have really too many heavy tanks. Like, as many as I would like. Let's put, all, let's put a lot of our funding into uh, these AACs, the uh, Mark III's. Some more APCs. Uh, we'll, put, we'll make this a money-making facility. This plan is going to... Th this is Mygito. Mygito is about to pump credits out like crazy. Just letting you know right now. Uh, Golans, Golans, Star Destroyers. Uh, let's see. They got a lot of stuff everywhere, man. And for some reason, all my stealth units are not sending with each other now. They're like, every time I try to... 
pull just like the whole group they just they don't do it it's kind of it's kind of weird it's kind of bugged i don't know why all right so we got the rest of the assault frigates building over, over here oh that's right we only have two frigate yards there we got three each over here so i might just pump out over the remainder of those uh frigates here Yeah. And then our mediate our second mediator is back again. Alright. The Empire actually has some starships here for once. Alright. So yeah, we're gonna have to recommit to the attack on uh Chandrilla's orbit again, which is okay. Well, you know, we'll make do with what we got. Um our fleets are a little all organized right now because we had so many different strategies employed to deal with the Hapen threat, which stopped being a threat a while ago. Also, why is this not a stealth unit? Weird. Um, I've got a variety of capital ships building up over here, too. Okay. I'm gonna cut the hammerheads from the fleet for the time being. Um, I want to get I want to get more frigates built. I want to get a lot more of the smaller ships built because we don't really have too many of them. Now, I like I like having my swaths of corvettes, so we we'll, we're gonna splurge a little bit on these little guys, and then we're gonna invest in the more quasars too. But all right, this fleet's looking pretty damn solid. Uh, we'll wait for the remainder of the reinforcements to get over here. Yeah, see, what the heck? Okay, never mind. Got a mission. Both of these are gonna give us a uh, one XQ one mistress station. Where can I even build one of those at right now? Yeah, that's almost done. Okay, so we got we got plenty of we got plenty of our vehicles that are building right now. Uh, we'll let all that stuff finish up. There's actually some actual defenses at Chandrilla this time too. I'm here for it. I don't know if it can handle all these units coming into it now that I think about it. Yep. Okay. Actually, let's look at the Battle Dragons. They have no place in the Republic fleet right now. Put the Interdictor here. Uh, okay. Okay, okay. I'm done, I'm done, I'm done uh, organizing. This this is all looking pretty solid. I think we can put the B-Wings and stuff back in here. Let's go. What is this? Okay. All right, let's go. A rematch at Chandrilla because the game crashed. <laughs> All right, this should be really easy though. You've got two Mediator class battle cruisers and a variety of other support ships. This should be a cakewalk, unless they call in another Star Destroyer, which it doesn't look like they're gonna do. Okay, let's call in one, two. Three, four quasars. You call them one mediator class. Two assault frigates. Two assault frigate mark twos. Let's see, so eight, so that would be make that one ninety six. Yeah, much corvettes had a slightly lower pop cap, but that's okay. Okay. Hey, this is not too shabby. Hey, wing reporting. Hey, wing reporting. Let's get everybody grouped up. Ready for orders. Reporting in. Hey, gonna, reporting. Yeah, this is going to be a fun little strategy. TIE Fighters. What the? Well, what the fuck? Why did I just have control over TIE Fighters for a hot second? What the hell? I don't even want to know. I'm just going to get that out of the group right now. I think we're reaching our, 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 our end with this uh, save. 
We got we got we got to progress. All right, so let's make this quick. Let's go. K-wing squadron here. Okay. X-wings. We got a bunch of fighters now. All right. All star fighters stay up ahead. Let's do this, everybody. Quasars, you follow closely behind. This should be a pretty brutal battle for the most part. We should be able to really just steamroll here. This will be a little bit more exciting because they've got the Star Destroyer. It'll be a repeat of the previous battle, kind of, but, you know, we gotta do what we gotta do. Okay. We're approaching. The mediator should be able to strip the shields of relatively anything with little difficulty. Um, then we'll use the assault frigates and stuff to finish everything off, pretty much. We should be approaching them any second. There they are. What is that? Is that a Victory Mark III? That's a horror class destroyer. Okay, note it. Starfighters, you stick to the right. Not too many ties. There we go. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move the mediator class forward. You take on that star destroyer. Let's negate all that damage right now. Okay. All right, all units, focus fire on that center star destroyer. Uh, you assault frigates are gonna go aim for that horror class. Bombers, try to get in there. Quasars, you stick behind kind of closely for those necessary reinforcements. A lot of bombers are gonna sneak, a lot of fighters are gonna sneak through on our left flank. It is what it is. That's it, get its shields all stripped down. We already lost our A-wings. We need help over here badly. We've already lost the shields on one of our uh, assault frigates. Okay. Yeah, our, our left flank is a little... is collapsing just a smidgen. I'm gonna call it a... Never mind, I'm not gonna call it in. I was gonna call it a nebula. Nebulon, but... Okay. We'll worry about that later. Where are our bombers at? Have they cut through? Yeah, they're there. Okay. Assault frigates, you make your move. Get out of there. Go, go, go. That's a lot of damage on this very powerful version of the victory class. Alright, all, Assault Frigate Mark II is a mediator class. Just focus your fire down on that Star Destroyer. Okay. The yeah, assault frigates might make it out. We got a little too. We got a little too uh, careless there. The quasar should be able to help deal with what's left of the star fighters. Let's micro that just a smidgen. Pick up those bombers right there. You guys push back. Okay. P uh, fighters, come on in. The Quasars have no business actually being this close. Holy smokes. You can turn around and rejoin the battle. There we go. Shut his engines down. Shut his engines down. He's going to try to cut through the fleet. There we go. Do we have any fighters that need to be regrouped or anything? Hmm. Yes, 
We've lost our fair share of uh, T-65s. I didn't mean to push them up that close. That's just a tactical error on my part. But with the way the fighters are starting to look, I figured, okay, we need to kind of get those up there, help them deal with some of those assholes just a little bit. Take out the tractor beam emitter. Here we go. I think it'll be okay now. Now that thing's dead as hell. <laughs> Are we really gonna... It just got finished off by TIE Interceptors. That's the most textbook rebel thing you could probably have happen. TIE Fighters destroy some, some massive capital ship. It's not a capital ship, but, you know. Compared to everything else, it's pretty damn big compared to the Starfighters, anyway. Stick that out. Plenty of TIE Bombers coming in on our flank, or behind the uh, Mediator class. That's it. Concentrate all efforts on taking him out. I honestly thought he might have been dead by now. Okay. Launching more E-Wing support. K-Wings, get in there with your turrets and uh, kind of help him out a little bit. And your missiles. They got a lot of everything, man. They got proton torpedoes, assault missiles, artillery rockets. Like, hey, they got a lot of stuff, man. Quasar, circle back around. I mean, I'll take a Quasar loss of anything. Like, we've lost it. A, we, we didn't lose our assault frigates. Quasars are equally as valuable. Fighters pull back. You hold position. Until I have all fighters pull back. Quasars, you move up. Fighters pull back. We'll group up in the same area. Actually, uh, 80, uh, yeah, 86, they order come back. <laughs> we got side bombers uh, doing their thing. They might not be able to really do much on paper, but. Yeah, just shoot the rest of those sides down. Okay, Nebula, Nebulon rather. Wow, that's such a good shot, dude. Look at that. Look at that. Alright. Oh, they're just sitting there getting eaten. Hold on. There we go. Yes, yes. Cool. Alright, pull back. No need to fly against these AA-focused stations. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I let my left flank collapse a little bit. That's my mistake. Okay, that's one. Okay, that's two. And then that should be the last one. Those ties are slowly but surely getting destroyed. Yep, just rip it apart. Nice. We lost a few X-Wings and then a Quasar, so. Just one minor misclick on my part. I didn't mean for them to get that close, but, you know, it is what it is. We, we've got the infrastructure to build more, I mean, let's be realistic here. And speaking of realism, let's save. Let's save right now. As you can see, I've got this titled Akbar Alive. Because the first time, the first time I attempted to, re, to reset everything up, I... I gotta admit, ever since we started really making money and stuff in this, I've, I've gotten a little bit more careless than I would like to admit. Which is... Yeah, I mean, I've gotten a little too careless. So. <clears throat> Alright, as soon as we get this save uh, finished, we will commit to Chandrilla. And hopefully it won't crash this time. It didn't crash the last time. Uh, on the second attempt of recording. So. We'll see how it goes. Anytime now. Yeah, anytime now. I probably should start deleting a lot of these old saves. I've got saves from like 2019, I think, on this computer. That's when I built this computer, so yeah, I've got saves from 2019 on here. Okay. Okay, let's send all of our troops down. 
Yeah. They might not wait for. That threw me off so hard. We did just get two free MC40s though. Okay. Okay, we we got a lot of power in that fleet. There you go. Okay, yeah, we can wait for that last group of uh hefty tanks to get down here. There we go. The force will guide me. I'm pretty certain at least one of those bladers is gonna be a Bill Brady. We still got a rescue rogue squadron. I uh, didn't want to open the floodgates of hell just yet by attacking this planet, but if we, well, that's the thing. We don't know what's over here, Bill Brinky. We can't really spy on it either. Whoa. Got way too much happening over here, buddy. Well, let me move some stuff around real quick before the game strokes out. There we go. There we go. All right. That's crazy how that used to be our primary fleet, and ever since then, it really hasn't done anything of like higher importance. We're gonna build a few new of a uh, few of the um, MC80B types because we have like we only have like one, and let's go. Oh uh, yeah, AA units. Okay. Scared me for a hot second. Thought it was gonna crash. Okay, I'm gonna call in some uh, anti-air uh, tanks. Uh, we have our U-wing. So if we have any fighter support, oh no, the civilians. We must go. Yeah, get up there now. Go ahead of everybody. Actually, don't go ahead of everybody. Damn. They obliterated his ass. Well, they're the AA units. We take those out now. We have an advantage. There we go. Turn around, Yui. Turn around. Missile tubes loaded. Ready for uh, let's go. Let's just get up here. Okay. You guys stay over here. Kind of maintain some distance. We'll secure this landing zone. Tie fighters inbound. Back off, back off, back off, back off, back off. There we go. Alright, we're starting to get lit up over here a little bit. Come down, come down south, come down south, come down south. You wings, what are you what are you doing there, buddy? Just give the order, sir. What is it? That's a lot of tanks. Cut across over here. Move down, move down, move down. Go, go, go. Okay. We're getting lit up by those TIE fighters, dude. Okay, concentrate all fire on that big gun right there. Take it out. Go, go, go. That U-Wing is done for. Okay, circle back around. You're you're in no man's land, brother. Okay, we got more infantry support down here. That's nice. That's it. Oh, this looks cool, actually. 
Nancy, just hold this defensive line or this assault, this attacking line. I don't know what you want to call it. I'm trying to. I'm throwing military terms out there for the hell of it. Or words. Military cool sounding things. Let's uh, secure this. We're going to repair our units before we make the final push into the base. To secure this, we're going to put a repair facility right here really quick. <clears throat> it's probably a little unnecessary. Probably should have secured this way earlier. That's for certain. Alright, I like that sound effect. That's that's different. <laughs> What's happening over here? Okay, let's go. That's it. Shoot those sides down. Look at all those rockets. <laughs> Infantry units, move up. Ready for command. Roger this. Okay. Actually, you stay out of dodge, bro. Just, just stay over here. What's over here? Back off a smidgen, lads. You're running up in there. I just realized we can call in, uh... Call in V-Wings. Ah, Droid works. Oh, and shit, Droid. This is our first time seeing K-Wings in support. Jeez. They didn't even drop their main payload yet. That's insane. It's kind of nuts how much of an effect ground units or uh, uh, sorry, orbital units can have. Get in there, V-Wings. It's kind of crazy, like, you have the right type of bomber in the sky, and they can do way more damage than just your average, you know. Okay, you guys can back off. Let's just do all this stuff. Here we go. That should be it. Nice. Okay, we lost uh, one of these, one of our other heavy tanks. I think we still keep the groups. Yeah, we kept the groups. Nice. Okay. I got a dreadnought cruiser. Well, oh wait, what? I don't want me to take control of Yaga for a dreadnought. That's insane. You're out of your mind, man. Yaga for a dreadnought cruiser. Beginning construction. That is that legitimately on paper is not worth it. I mean, we're gonna have to attack Yaga eventually anyway, but to attack one of the biggest imperial shipyards. Functioning shipyards of that in the galaxy For a dreadnought cruiser Upgrade under construction Okay Okay so we made some incredible progress. I think we might attempt to... How long are we in on this video? We're already like 40-something minutes in. Uh, I mean, what is this? Okay, they've got a ground to planetary turbo laser. Good to know. Okay. In the next episode, we'll commit a full assault on Kuat. That'll be probably most of the episode. We're going to take the shipyards of Kuat finally from the grasp of the Empire. Um, and then we might strike Bill Bringy too. I'm going to see... Actually, yeah, let's let's see what kind of units they have over there really quick. I think I did this once already. One of those bladers is almost done too. Oh. Alright, well there's the other belader. Alright. Next episode, everybody. We attack Kua, we attack Bill Bringy. We take out these massive Imperial What the hell is happening down here? We might actually come over here. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna come over here first. <laughs> well, we'll take out Kua and then we'll send the we'll send um the Rendili, we'll send a, we'll, we'll, we'll guard the orbit of this planet with, 
some fleet. We'll, we'll probably allocate a few ships from this primary fleet up here. Um, because they're doing something down here and I don't like it. So, all right, thanks so much for watching, everybody. If, you, if you're new here, be sure to leave a like on the video, uh, sub to the channel for more Star Wars and other gaming content, man, and uh, vlogs and all that stuff. And as always, everybody, I will see you later. May the Force be with you all. Peace.